but like oh. the makeup of their quarterback room That's what we makes need to it talk about. feel like they weren't really trying to do everything they could to win this year. You know, they had an opportunity right. last year to draft Carson Wentz. We all know that. They had an opportunity this year to draft Mitchell Trubisky, to, to, to Sean Watson, like tons of guys. Right. And they chose – it's like they're building the team for the way out future. And you look at the makeup of their quarterback room, and you look at the quarterback rooms around the league, they don't have a guy in their quarterback room that has ever won one NFL game. Not one. Well, you yeah. said Not they're building. Guy. You said they're building a future. What year are they going to start? Well, and that's but, my question. But, like, but, to win. win. No, but, not but, build. You know what? To that's win. a great point because everybody is on a level playing field financially. You know what I mean? If you don't win, you get fired. As simple as that. But the thing that, that you look at is there's something wrong with their board. They're waiting to, to you know, uh, for guys to walk and get on base, hit a three-run shot. How's that been? That's been a dang disaster, right? Bringing in the baseball guys, analytic yep. guys. Get, draft a football player. And by the way, don't grade players the same way. If you have a quarterback and you don't have a quarterback, mm -hmm. his grade should be different than, you know, a Randy Moss, a, a Charles Woodson. All those guys right there are great players. However, you better put a little more priority on a quarterback, and you've passed two years in a row on drafting a franchise quarterback. 